this video, we fly in style to Palma, Mallorca in Spain to board an absolutely beautiful Lagoon 52 from Navigar Yachting and sail around the Mediterranean. Our friend Bob owns a Falcon 50 and was flying to Spain and offered to give us a lift to Mallorca. This is the type of plane I used to fly when I was a corporate pilot. It was really nice to be able to sit in the back of one of these for a change instead of up front. Where are we going, Seth? Mallorca. Mallorca. So our really good friend will introduce him here in just one second. Uh, Bob has his private airplane and we are flying to Mallorca to go sailing. Flying class. What? It's a flying class. Flying class. Flying in class. Oh, flying in class. Like, oh my, flying too early class? for him. Are we going to class? I don't know what you're talking about. So we have a Lagoon 52 chartered and say hello to Bob. Hey, how are you, how are you doing? We, uh, so we did a video on your old yacht a while back. Yes, so. we did, that yeah. Westport. Yeah, yeah, we did. That was a lot of fun. So he's been Probably for... the least viewed video you yeah. had. Well, unfortunately, there's no girls in bikinis on yeah, it. Yeah. We fixed that now. We brought a couple girls there on it. There we so. go. We're going to have a better time. Uh, yeah. So uh, we are headed to Mallorca to go sail on a Lagoon 52. And uh, we've been friends for about three or four years. Or more than that now, I don't know. Correct, uh, correct. So, we're going to have a lot of fun. Well, thanks for giving us a ride out there. Yeah, we're going to take Emma with us, too, yeah, she's, and if this, she's good. This I'm, is she's good. Emma. Say hello, she's Emma. Good. Hello. Yeah. So, are you excited about this? So excited. You've never really done any sailing, though, right? No, never. All right, well, we're, we're going to have a good time. I know Steph's ready. I'm ready to be on a boat. Yeah, yeah let's get back on the boat. Guys, let me talk to you about the sponsor of this video, Babbel. Babbel is one of the top language learning apps on the market. Just 10 to 15 minutes a day can have you learning a new language in as little as three weeks. We're here in Spain traveling around, so I thought it was the perfect time to brush up on my Spanish using Babbel. The lessons are a lot of fun. They actually gamify their lessons, so it's kind of fun. You play a little game, and you uh, interactive, and you learn how to speak Spanish, or any language you want. It's been really exciting being in here in Spain and being able to use all the language skills I learned from Babbel. Right now, they have a special offer. If you use the link down in the description, you can get 60% off your entire order with Babbel. So it's, re it's been really great being able to use Babbel and learn Spanish, and uh, it's been really helpful down here in the islands. Bobby, me pasas el libro y la toalla, por favor? See, because of Babbel, I know she wants her book and a towel. Gracias. De nada. Kannst du mir bitte auch mein Buch bringen? Well, now I need to learn German. So thank you to Babbel for sponsoring this video. Be sure to click the link down in the description to get 60% off your next order with Babbel. Gracias. Adios. Gracias. Adios. What do you say? Wait, okay. <laughs> it was a pretty great way to travel as we crossed the Atlantic over to Spain. It seemed like time flew by and then the island of Mallorca appeared in the window. Off the plane, we loaded into a van and headed to the marina. This is Palma, the largest city in Mallorca. Unfortunately, we didn't have a whole lot of time to explore that city. So this is the Navigar base here in Mallorca and Palma. Our boat is at the very end. We will give you a tour of that a little later. Right now we're just storing our luggage because the boat's not quite ready yet. They got to clean it. Um, so we're going to put the camera away while we go to launch and do some provisioning and then we'll pick you back up when we're getting on the boat. Yes. You ready? Yeah. So this is it guys. We're all moved on. We got the safety briefing. We got the technical briefing. We are about to head out right now. 
Uh, it is a Lagoon, that's Alberto with Navigar Yachting. So we did get this boat from Navigar Yachting. They're a great company. Uh, they have bases all over the world. They have more than 300 boats in their fleets. I think it's like 12 or 13 bases, I'm not sure. It's kind of like a charter ownership boat program. So you can buy the boat, put it in charter with them, and you get six to 12 weeks a year at no additional cost on your own boat. And you can use boats around the world. It's a pretty cool option. Uh, so check them out if you want to charter or own your own boat. Uh, but let me introduce you a couple more crew members and then we'll get underway. We'll give you a proper tour on this boat in the next video. All right, let's head inside and meet everybody else. All right, so here we are. You've already met Emma and Bob. <laughs> and hey, then, how are you? <laughs> how are you? The other two crew members, we have Lada. And Bryce. And uh, so, guys, introduce yourselves. Where are you from? Uh, what's going on? Yeah. Hi, I'm Lotta. I'm from Germany. And Bryce and I started traveling the world three months ago. And yeah, now we're in the boat. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much sums it up, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. Where are you from? Uh, I'm from New Zealand, though. Right. Haven't been back in like three years, mainly because of the coronavirus. But uh, yeah, been traveling the world with Lotta for, for three months. And before then, living in Germany. So. Excited to be here. Cool. Well, glad to have you guys. Uh, you've never done any sailing, really, or anything? No, not really. Okay. Have you? A little bit, yeah. A little bit. On smaller boats. All right. Like well, <laughs> we got, we're waiting on one little thing, and then we're ready to get off talk. You ready, guys? Yep. Woo! Let's, go. Let's do it. So this is the flybridge of the Lagoon 52. Really spacious up here. It's amazing how much more space. We were, we were in Lagoon 460 not long ago. Six extra feet gives you so much more space. But we're about to start the engines and get going. With the engines warmed up, Steph pulled in the passerelle and we were getting off the dock. A little stressful getting off the dock, especially on a boat you don't know. But Good job. In a place you don't know. Ah. Thanks guys, we'll see you later. Kind of cool feature of this you can move the wheel out of your way which is interesting i've never actually had a wheel that does that before the mediterranean is one of my favorite places to sail and it felt good to be back There's nothing quite like the feeling of hoisting the sails and just cruising. The crew were relaxing and getting to know each other and it was a pretty great first sail. In mid-September, the water temperature was perfect. After just a few hours, it was time to pull in the sails. You show me how to dare to love. So tell me what you're thinking of. We pulled into our first anchorage of the trip.
sailed about 15 miles to Santa Ponca. One of the things I do like about this davit system, it does have a powered winch for pulling the dinghy up and down because it's a pain in the ass to like do it by arm. The thing I don't like is it requires two different lines to pull the dinghy up. So you gotta have a, a one line to lower the back and one line to lower the front, and it's just it's kind of a pain having to switch lines. You gotta do you gotta switch a couple times. So like I lower the back about there, then I have to close this hook up the other line to the to the uh, winch open this let this one down all the way and then I got to switch back to the other one and do it again so I mean whatever first world problems but still now we're ready to go to them. One of my favorite things about cruising the Med is all the seaside cafes and restaurants. Made it through the first day. Nobody died. Uh, I think we had a good time so far. Yeah, that's reassuring. Yeah, well, yeah. Nice little, nice little cruise. Nice little nice cruise. Nice little cruise. So uh, to uh, one day in paradise and to many more. There you go. Cheers to you guys. Thanks for watching. Guys, I have some really exciting news. So back in July, we had a flotilla with eight boats and it was wildly successful. Everybody had a great time. In fact, it was so successful that Navigar asked me if we could do another one. So we offered that to the people that already did the last one and most of them already signed up. So they said, okay, we need to do another one. So now we've got two flotillas coming up in the BBI. Uh, the first one is December 10th through the 17th in the BBI. And the second one is January 23rd through the 30th, also in the BBI. Uh, half the boats in that second one in, the, in January are already filled up, but there are spaces available for the December and a few left for January. There's a link down in the show notes to if you would like to reserve a boat. So depending on the make and model of the boat, some of the boats are four cabins, some are six. Uh, they range in price from about eight or 9,000 to about 12 or 13. Uh, but if you split that with you know four or five, six other couples, uh, then it becomes fairly reasonable. Uh, they are doing it by the boat this time. Uh, so basically uh, the best way to do it is if you and a bunch of friends want to go reserve your own boat and there you go. If you don't have enough people to fill a boat, I'm going to put a link down to the uh, Sailing Doodles Facebook page where uh, I have a, I don't know, a little message going about uh, everybody kind of pairing up and all that. And don't worry about pairing up. It worked really well last time. So the people in all the boats last time, most of them didn't know each other and they ended up being on the same boat and it worked out really well. In fact, pretty much all those boats that are coming back, it's all the same people in the same boat. They had such a great time and they got along really well together. So uh, guys, I'm looking forward to seeing you in the BBI and thank you for Navigar for helping set this up. So remember December 10th through the 17th and January 23rd through the 30th in the BBI, let's go sailing together. I'll be with you leading the way.